Hi everyone. Bringing in the new year. So this book is about lunar year. Written by Grace Lynn. Do you see the picture here? The cover page here? Look. So let's turn the page here. Do you can see? This is the first page of this book. Here. Look. We can see a family here, right? Parents and their kids. If the new year coming, I hope so. We try to welcome it in. So kids are asking those questions to their parents. So the next page here, look. So they are all busy cleaning their house and decorating, right? So Gigi sweeps the old ear out of the house. Here. So that's you sweep your house and sweep away all the old dirt, right? So on this bed, what do we see? You see, they are helping each other to decorate the house. Baba hangs the spring happiness poems. Let's turn the page. Here. So, and on this page, what did we see? We see Mama makes the get rich dumpling. Look at here. These are the dumpling. Here. Everybody is busy. Everybody is helping to welcome the new year. So on this page, look, looks like somebody is having a haircut. May May gets a fresh haircut. Mama is giving May May a fresh haircut. Cutting her bangs. And on this page, look here, they are wearing all their traditional dresses. And I put on my new key palm. Wear my new key palm dress for the new year fest. Now, will the new year come? So I asked my co-worker, Anna, she said, this is how they pronounce. I tried my best to pronounce the proper way. Key palm. So this is the special key palm dress they wear on the New Year Festival. So on this page, look. Pop, pop, pop. Do you hear the firecrackers? Are they bringing in the New Year? They celebrate their New Year with firecrackers. So this is the noise they are hearing. Look at them. One person is covering her ear. ear. Let's turn the page. On this page, look here. Let's see what is happening here. No, but they brought in the lions. They are here to scare away last year's bad luck. So, this is the lion. So the firework is not going to bring the new year. But the lions are here to what, scare away the bad luck. Whatever bad is going away. They scare Mamie too. Oh, so here. So Mamie. She got scared to see the lions. But these are not real lions, right? Don't cry, Mei Mei. Let's turn the page here on this page. Look, kids are having fun. Where is the new year? So these kids, all of them, they are waiting for the new year. We carry the lanterns to light its way. 
I hope the new year follows us soon. So they are all, look, they're all carrying lantern. So lantern has light. They are carrying the lanterns to light the way so that the new year can come. So let's turn the page on this page. What do we see here? You see a dragon here? Yeah, that's the face of it. Dragon. Look, there is the dragon. Auntie is waking him up by opening his eyes. Hmm. So the dragon was sleeping. Auntie is drawing her eyes on it. The new year must be coming. So the new year must be coming. That's what all the children here, they think. Let's turn the page. Wow, here, do you see the dragons and all the children here? So, what? Would you like to see that? Long dragon. Let's open the page. Did you see it? Now we see the face of the dragon and look how big, how long the dragon is. Wow. Long dragon. Hmm. Yes, hooray, the new year is here. Happy new year, everyone. So finally, the new year is here. Everybody is so happy, look at that. Lunar year was uh, known as Chinese New Year, but now commonly called Lunar New Year. Yeah, so it's not just the Chinese, other nations over there on that part of the world, they all celebrate this New Year. And why do they call it Lunar Year? Because it's based on, on the lunar calendar and many other countries besides China observe it. All, all those countries they celebrate this lunar year too. And this lunar year is one of the most celebrated event in the world. So it says in this book, let's read it from this. It is such an important festival that it traditionally lasted for 15 days ending with the Lantern Festival. Nowadays, however, most people just celebrate for one day. It is a time for families and friends to get together and is the biggest, most exciting event of the year. On so these days, all the families, if they stay away from each other, you know, these days we, we go different, different places for their job and other, work so on these days they all come together the whole family relatives they come together and celebrate with beautiful beautiful stuff like they they make food they decorate their uh, houses to right. celebrate this festival people prepare almost a month ahead of time they get rid of their old stuff, clean everything and good wishes are put up out to welcome the new lunar year. Also they make sure there are plenty of food and clothes for everyone. And right, they bring the lucky dragon to bring good luck. luck. When a new dragon used for a parade, it can be woken up by an eye-opening ceremony. This simple ceremony paints in the eyes of the dragon so he can see the symbolic sun. The dragon chases the sun around and around, ensuring that we will have many nights and days. His chase is accompanied by many merrymakers. Days at the here, look at hmm. They are the merrymakers. 
some stuff they use during welcoming the new year. Boo, what? Orange, dumpling, and the trays keep on. And drum, what? Fire crackers. So that's how people who celebrate lunar year, they welcome their year. They welcome their new year. So let's welcome the lunar year too. Happy new year to all our friends who are celebrating the lunar year. So that's all for today. Bye-bye.